Whoa. <laughs> Before I hurt myself, let me tell you guys what this thing is. This is a lantern softbox from a company called Laufas. This is a very unique modifier and they're relatively new to the market. And I've been waiting for a while to get this thing, but it's always been sold out on Amazon. And what's really unique about this is that it provides omnidirectional soft light. Traditional soft boxes give us one direction of light. This thing gives us a full 360 of light. But before I show you exactly how it looks on a subject, and that subject being me, uh, let me show you how to put this thing together. So the first thing that you're gonna pull out of the case that you get with it is this thing. This is the frame of the light. And what happens is, is it's kind of like a spring-loaded system. So when you press down on it, that's when it starts to form that shape. So you press down and then you hook the little latch at the bottom and it will just stay like that. Now picture this, but with the softbox material attached. Uh, let me show you how to actually put it together now. So push down and it will release just like that. Here's the softbox material. So now we put the frame inside of the material as so. Now bring the material up. Press down on the frame and latch it. Nice. Now we can secure the Velcro. And there you go. It's that easy. So on the back, we have a mount here. This is a Bowens mount. It's metal, obviously. And this means it will attach to most uh, light fixtures, such as the Aperture 120Ds, the Godox lights, which is actually what I'm currently using this modifier with and it's just a simple quick lock design. You just push and twist and it will lock right in. Now the frame itself is made out of stainless steel while the Bowens mount is made out of aluminum. There are several different ways on how you can mount this light. I actually love using this modifier to help me produce room light. All I need to do is attach it to my Godox light, then mount the light onto my boom stand, mount it up high, and it'll provide you even lighting within your room. This is especially important for those of you who want to simulate a chandelier or any other overhead light fixture. You can also use it as a traditional softbox. You can have it pointed at a 45 degree angle and it will still cast a beautiful soft light onto your subject. And yes, it will produce those nice evenly lit skin tones. Overall, this is a great modifier for your light. There's a few little things that I think they can improve upon in their next version of this light modifier. I think that the frame kind of slips out out of where it needs to be. So make sure that when you do put the frame inside of the material that you Velcro this thing up tight, otherwise it might slip and it just might deform the look of the light. So keep that in mind. Also, the elastic bands that are on the light modifier are pretty fragile and I actually broke one of mine. So honestly, you don't really need to use it, but if you do decide to use it to secure it to the uh, Bowens mount, just try to be a little bit careful with it because I snapped mine pretty easily. Overall, this is a fantastic modifier and I highly do recommend it, especially for those of you who want to recreate that room light. If you're interested, check out the link down below. They do sell out really fast. I had to wait about five to six weeks to get mine. So make sure you order it immediately. I promise you, this is gonna be one of the favorite things that you use with your light fixtures. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a like if you enjoyed yourself and subscribe to my channel with those notifications turned on and stay tuned for a really funny blooper. And now I'm gonna start pressing down on the frame so that way it starts to form the shape of the light. And now let me latch the bottom. Oh! Am I becoming an amateur again? Like this is...